Welcome back to One Hour Limit Locked, where I race to complete some of RuneScape's most iconic challenges, whilst limited to just one hour of gameplay each day. In Season 1, we got ourselves a fire cape in 46 days, and in Season 2, we achieved Barrow's Gloves in just another 38. But now, in Season 3, it's time for our toughest challenge yet. The question is, how many days will it take us to complete our first ever raid on the account? We not only have to get ourselves geared and leveled up just to step inside a raid, we then have to complete it in under one hour, as logging out in the middle will end our run. I've no idea how long this is going to take me, but I can't wait to find out, so join me for the journey here in Season 3 of One Hour Limit Locked, as we become a Tomb Raider. Hello everybody and welcome back, we are about to kick off day number 5 here of our third season. Yesterday was fucking atrocious. Let's not make any bones about it. It was a terrible, terrible day from start to finish. I'm hoping today will not be quite as dismal. We did just have that bird to finish off that birdhouse. And now I am going to reset my invent to do another birdhouse run before the farm run. The plan today is to do a legends quest. Or at least as much of it as we can knock out. Brought on too many logs there, but oh well. Yeah, we got a tiny bit of mining to knock out, but then I'm um, on to Legends quest after that. And I'm hoping we should be able to get most of it done today. There's a hunter level to start things out. Okay, that's the bird house is done. Time to do the farm run. Not many nests recently. Did just get a palm tree seed though. That's an extra 15k in the bag. I'm actually going to keep the pickaxe on me for the minute. Just so we can finish off at the Ardy Patch and do the, whatchamacallit, do the Iron Rocks next to it. Sorry, my brain is trying to compute too many things at once. <laughs> yes, we can go, we can do the Ardy Patch last and then go to the Iron Rocks that are right next to the patch basically to do the end of our mining training, which we only need like, yeah, we're, we're like two minutes away from the level we want. Just going to claim one runner check the price at the minute. Yeah, the clean ones are actually worth more again now. I think it is usually the case that clean ones are worth more. It just seemed to be off the other day. There is 36 farming coming in as we do our fourth patch of the day. Third patch of the day? Third patch of the day. Now that's not bad at all. We managed to get today's burbs and herbs done in just around about six minutes, which is definitely our fastest a run so far. Wow, we actually just filled up our invent there. Gonna have to note these. Okay, a whole bunch of runars. Just gonna get them all noted and then run on down to the mines here. Got about 360k there, not bad at all. It's about triple the cost of the seeds, with six seeds costing 124k. So definitely very juicy. Now we just need to smash out this mining level. We don't actually have a teleport to the GE on us at the minute. There is the level we needed, so I'm just going to teleport to Varrock. Because we need to buy some stuff. And let's just crush these birds' nests. And we'll get those. And the Renars. We've still got our Renars from yesterday we didn't clean. Be a nice little cash infusion here to start the day off. Which is good because we're about to spend 100k on woodcutting boosts. Very nice indeed. Get that, get that, get that. Uh, get these to sell, may as well. Don't think there's anything else there. Alright, so we managed to get the uh, birds herbs and mining all done. 50 minutes still on the clock, so we've got quite a, a long way. Most of our sessions still remain in here, which is fantastic. Hopefully we should be able to get the majority of Legends quests done, if not all of it. Just gonna slap this stuff on the GE and buy myself a bunch of things. Look at that, almost 2 mil. Very nice indeed. Wait, I already did the charcoal part, didn't I? I don't actually need that anymore. Diamond, sapphire, more ruby. Literally selling an emerald. Just chisel that. Topaz. I think we actually need a couple of unpowered orbs, because we have to go through multiple times, so... I'm just gonna grab a few. Uh, runes we've got, they're just in a pouch. Gold bar, we need another one. And we've got Radimus's notes. So, we don't need the mapping. We've already mapped Karazi, if I'm 
correct. We just need to do that last bit to use them on someone. Chisel for this. Chisel, 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 chisel. Thank you. Okay. Let me get myself boots of lightness. Do we need combat gear for this bit? No. Not yet. Not for quite a bit, actually. So, we're probably going to end up teleporting out, aren't we, after we pick up the binding book. Yeah, yeah, to make a ball. Okay, so we don't need combat gear. We will just get our light stuff with us and everything we need for contacting the locals uh, and for unlocking the caves and getting a binding book. I'm going to take an extra lockpick in case it breaks because it can. A couple of... Do we have any menophyte remedy left? We've got one dose. Let's just change that into a four dose. And we will also grab ourselves the woodcutting boosts that I completely forgot about. M4. Is that four doses? 200k, I only need two doses. So we'll do that, that, and hope it buys. Oh gosh. This is going to be more expensive than I thought, in it? Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh, I'm not liking the look of this at all. Should we try four? Oof, it bought. Oh no. Now I have to actually use this. Well, <laughs> oh, it's all okay, it's all okay. Let's go. Energy, regular energy. I don't think we'll be able to sell half of it back either, will we? Because it only had like the four doses there, I'm pretty sure. I should tag the bushes so that, I don't know why I've never done that. Oh, I'm not going through though. I'm using it on him. Can you give me the ball roarer? Thank you. It's like this one and this one. Well, go on, good job. Oh, I need the agility right now. So this doesn't take too many attempts. Oh my gosh. What is going on? 54 agility with these boosts. Not enough. Oh, finally. We only have to go through there like six more times today. Oh, we're straight back out. Isn't that nice? No, don't be wolfing on me. Oh, you're a prick. Okay. Oh, we're going straight back in. That's lovely. That is lovely. Fourth fail on this mossy rock. It was through. I should have brought a dueling ring. That was really dumb of me. Oh, we got through that one first try. Fuck off, evil Bob. Oh, I forgot to bring my minifight remedy as well. That was kind of dumb, huh? Oh, here was where I wanted it for, because it drained your levels. We will be coming through here a second time, though. Smashing this out, to be honest. Pretty sure it's over here, it appears. Oh, it's gonna lock us over there, knock us over here anyway. And then we teleport out to make a ball, I think. I didn't bring any teleports, so I'm gonna have to use the grouping teleport to LMS. We want to go to an anvil, not a furnace. Okay, we're gonna need our combat gear for the next part as well. So, time to switch outfits, but we will just get this bit done first with the anvil, actually. Varrock, I guess? Smithing level of at least 50? I did not realise. Do we have a Dwarven? We do. There we go. Talk to... Da, 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 da. Do we not have to go back through the thing again at the minute? It doesn't... It's not saying we need all that shit, so... Yeah, I feel like we end up teleporting out again. So I don't think I need to bring everything. Just the uh, agility boost. And I've decided, folks, for this quest, I'm gonna take ranged because we don't need ranged levels, true, but it's just gonna be far, far quicker than any other alternative. Trying to do it with melee is gonna take us literal years, and we don't have years, so it's gonna be a ranged ting. I don't know if we have any sort of hat. We've got a coif that we made the other day, why not? Fuck it, we'll, we'll rock the coif. Why the hell not? I don't even know if we need all this shit anymore. I don't think we need the sketch, do we? Prayer potions. For blessing the gold ball. Range potion. Ooh, we got one dose. So we'll need to pick up some more. Why don't we get a wealth and stick it on? And actually just go straight there now. Get ourselves an extra range potion. Four dose. Jesus. So I want to get this almost done today and we're already halfway through the day. We've done two sections. I may have overestimated or underestimated the amount of time this will take. <sighs> Ever so slightly. Ever so slightly. I don't know how long all these steps are though. 
but we haven't done a fight yet and there's like three fights in this quest three boss fights and other fights been a long way to go still definitely gonna be a two session job oh, oh. i swear to god you fucking wolf make sure i'm rapid oh I didn't bring food either. That was kind of dumb. Oh, please don't turn me too many times. There we go. Excellent. Use this on him, right? See, even with range, this isn't that fast, but it's definitely better than the alternative. Sort of taken actual years with melee. And this is just the first one. Okay, so we use the water on these. Oh, maybe we only needed one dose. Oh my gosh. I thought we needed a dose for that as well to germinate the seeds. Well, that's not good. I think I'm gonna need more summer fires as well. Only got that one left. I don't know how many more times we have to boost. Ew, it's all sludgy. Okay, do I have Adrigo? I have it all in the bank, I think. So let's just go to... I need to boost though. I need to boost. I didn't buy the her blow pies either. Pretty sure it's this one. Summer buy, summer buy, summer, summer, summer buy. Okay, now we need all the shit to go through. I think I'm just going to have to redo my invent entirely. To the source. Don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. Oh. I thought we needed a herb law level for that. That was weird. I hope I did that right and I didn't just fuck something up because that felt weird. I guess we didn't need the botanical? I don't know. It's weird what you do and don't have to boost for here. It doesn't really make 100% sense to me. Okay, pretty sure we have it all. We're just gonna head back. Oh, let's get some food this time as well. Is it gonna have registered that I drank the potion? I've made a bravery potion. Cool. Open my quest log just updates when I start going through the mossy rocks. Ah, it's still telling me to make a bravery potion. The fuck? It's a good job I know what I'm doing here. Oh, now it's updated. Still forgot the fire remedy though. I don't even know if it bought, to be honest. Oh my god. I fell? Damn. Well, there's no other path, so I don't know what you expected me to do other than that. That wasn't too bad at all. Can I safe spot these guys? Do I have to use food? Or prayer, even, because I didn't bring prayer pots. Wait, did he give me anything? Oh yeah, he did. Okay, we're getting through it. Which one's quicker? I'm just gonna go kill Vialde. The rocks might be annoying, but we'll see. At least I've not failed at all. Please don't jinx it. Maybe it's easier going up. Did I get him? I think I did. I'm a bit concerned though because we got another fight here and I did not bring prayer pots. So I'm gonna have to flick. I'm hoping that it's just a melee fight. It's just gonna melee me. Oof. We're actually gonna get pretty close to finishing this. I don't think we're going to, but we're gonna get pretty close. Oh shit, he fully drew my pro. Oh no, that's not good. Never mind, I've safe spotted him. It's absolutely fine. Oh wait, it's casting on me. Well, at least we got D hide on and he doesn't seem to be hitting. Nice. Let's go. We got the blessed water. Okay. So we're gonna just teleport. We didn't bring a dueling ring, apparently. I mean, we might actually be able to finish this. Am I being crazy? Definitely gonna need prayer though. Let's get a fresh stam as well. I'm gonna need a little bit of invent space. Ah, oh, didn't really think that through. Guess I can just drop a food temporarily. Damn, my specs not recharged yet. That's annoying. Uh, drop. No, retaliate. The fuck, bro. Swing, swing. Pick that up. Find a patch. It's over here, I think. Yeah. Use. Fertile soil. Forty-five. This is what you need the herb law for. Okay. That might have stopped any chances of doing this today. I feel like it's probably actually just quicker to go to the Shiloh Village Bank though than teleport in and out. So that's what I'm gonna do. Still not sure when we need the wood coin boost either. I don't need the pickaxe or lock pick anymore either. That's extra ambient space. Clock's ticking though. I'm gonna be cutting it close. I'm not sure if I'll get a birdhouse run today. But we do still need an axe. And we want our pie that we did keep and not resell, thankfully. For them as well. well. We don't need that anymore either, do we? I am just going back over to the bush that I know because I know I can cut through it that way. There's germinated ground here too, by the looks of it. Fertile soil even. We need to get more water anyway. I didn't realise there was literally a spot right next to it. Alright, I'm gonna whack preserve on just in case this fails or something and we want to keep the boost. I just ate the wrong thing. Oh well, we got an agility boost. And we need the wood cutting as well, I think. Is what it just told me. And there's a wolf on me. 
Okay. Here we go. Oh no, it failed. It grew. It grew. Use the ball. Use the axe. Use the axe. Use the axe. We've got a totem pole. Let's fucking go. Okay, primarily on before we do this, and then use the totem pole on it. I think we're gonna finish this quest today, y'all. I don't think we're gonna get a birdhouse done as well. I just hope we can actually finish the fight off. I'm gonna use a spec now, because the fight's gonna go long enough that it'll recharge. I don't think I can sell this color. Oh, I can take the... I can pour it into beer glasses and sell the individual gla glasses of folly. Okay, we're all good. I was worried then that I might have fucked myself over on like 200k, because I don't think we need this again at this point. Alright, and now we do the main man. Easy peasy. Oh shit, he's gonna give me one last tap, innit? I should have put my melee on. Let's go. Oh, that's so good. They all doubted me. Nobody thought I could get it done today, but we have finished the Legends quest. We just need to go to hand in. The question is, do I do the birdhouses first? Make sure I get them in. Because I don't care if I don't actually hand in Legends quest today. I definitely did it all today. I think what I want to do is make sure I get my birdhouses done. So let's just get our shit out. Do we have any beer glasses? We have three. That is convenient. We would be chucking those on the GE. Sure, I'll take six pieces of clockwork, why the fuck not? Fair amount of ness on that run. Question is, will I actually make it to Radimus if I try now? Because I don't think I will. Whereas I can go to the GE and make sure I get those Axeman's Follies up. Plus all these that we just got. Ooh, you seed. 20k. Excellent. Just want to make sure we actually got those up for sale at the end of the day. Oh, we don't actually need that Minifair Remedy anymore, but if it buys, it buys, who cares? Well, today's been a pretty solid day, folks. We're up to about 1.8 mil on the cash stack, uh, with nothing really floating that we need to sell. We'll, we'll have a herb run ready for us tomorrow, and we've got tomorrow's seeds already bought, so we'll be up to just over 2 mil tomorrow, which is very nice indeed. We will be able to hopefully soon buy ourselves a Fury, which is one of the two major upgrades I would like to get online before starting my combat training. That'll be a huge help to us, so we're, we're knocking on the edge of that right now. We've got the Gilded Totem ready to hand in, which means there's 120k up for grabs. Our XP gain today has not been very good at all, but we're going to get 120k at the start of tomorrow. Which I think... Let's see. If I'm 52 and I want to get to 55, I'm on 130k. Yeah, I think I'm just going to put one on attack, and then we'll be almost 55, which is where I want my attack to be. And then I'm going to just whack the other three all on defense and get that up to around level 56 itself, which isn't too great, but it's a very slow skill to train in combat wise, and we need it the highest, so gotta put every little helps on it. It will at least give us the ability to wear the Nezi helm that we got last season and haven't put on yet, so that's nice. Gonna be a good start to the session tomorrow, and, and I have to think what we're doing after Legends Quest now, because Legends Quest is done. I have a couple of ideas, a couple of other small quests that I want to do, just for some extraneous XP rewards, and then I plan to move on to doing a bit of Slayer, to work towards Royal Trouble and Perilous Moons. That is the goal, anyway. But today, it's been a lot better day than yesterday. Yeah, we didn't get a lot of XP, like I said, but we made a decent bit of money just on our daily runs, and we finished Legends Quest all in one session. Pretty much one session. Hope y'all are continuing to enjoy the series. Special shout out to Snack Pack. Thanks for donating a bond to me last night. It was just nice to hear from fans. They hit me up in game and, and donated a bond. Both this account and my main account have um, membership for like a year. So it's not going to go on either of those. But it will probably go on the series I'm planning after season three of one hour limit locked is wrapped up which is going to be something valamore related i want to do like a valamore locked thing but slayer is needed to do a lot of the content in valamore and there's no slayer masters in valamore so i haven't figured out exactly what i'm gonna do yet i might do like a, a westerner thing where i can only go to zaya and valamore 
because then I would have access to Slayer still through Kona, but like an Iron Man thing, not not on our limit, just a, a totally new account locked to this side of the world, maybe. But yeah, that's probably all I'll go on. Thanks for the bond. It was nice to hear from you and your missus. If you'd like me to say it was nice to hear from you too, leave a comment down below, and I'm sure I'll find it nice, unless it's nasty. I'm looking at you, Santa. Hit the like video, hit the like video, hit the like button on the video as well, of course, to show all of your support to this series. It's been wonderful. Growing the channel and the community, I say it all the time, but I fucking love you guys, all right? And hit the subscribe button if you haven't already, so you can join that growing family. Other than that, though, there's nothing more for me to say than look after yourselves. Be lovely to one another, and I'll see you on the next one.